Good afternoon, friends. On the outset, let me wish all of you a very happy Valentine's Day. When the city is filled with the billboards and the hoardings of for the, all the romantic and young couples, the only thing comes to mm -hmm. mind for all those people having gone past through that stage. Getting, you know, all the uh, Mr. George Bernard Shaw has said that getting your heart's desire is a tragedy as much not getting your desire, heart's desire as you wish to. My friends, today I am going to think about it, what I said. And today I am going to talk about, on this beautiful day, three words for you to understand which will help you in your profession, working and normal building relationship. And these are engagement, persuasion and presentation. The secret of selling anything, marketing I feel, is nothing but engagement. The moment I realized that, I began to study what engagement uh, uh, happens. And I tell my friends now, and I'm telling you now to all my audiences, when a, any customer or a prospect says that I'm not interested, what it means that you are not interesting. The prospective customer will never say, you are not interesting. He or she will take the blame themselves and say, I am not interested. I am not interested is a, is, a synod, is a symptom. The problem is, you have failed to engage the other person in a way that they were willing to have some dialogue with you or any further communication with you. Or that they will perceive some value of difference in you versus the other people that they have met with. Engagement takes place when the right questions are asked. Questions about the other person that makes them stop and think. Consider new informations and respond in, uh, in, in terms of you. Engagement is so powerful that you cannot carry on conversation without it. You cannot have a social life without it. You cannot make any kind of sales or marketing without it. You cannot climb the uh, any corporate ladder in civil without it. And your ability to communicate even the most simple of challenges or ideas will be surely lost. And then comes these two words like persuasion and presentation. Engagement is an opportunity, an opportunity that will never be uh, harnessed if your prime objective is to engage people about you before you try to engage people about them. You can make more friends in two months by becoming interested in other people than you can in two years by trying to get other people interested in you. And similarly, if any customer, any potential customer says they are not interested, it means simply you are not interesting, my friend. Persuasion, again, is a bit of, uh, a bit like a magical trick. It seems mysterious and not easily replicable. Don't be tricked into magician's illusion. The art of persuasion is not as challenging to master as it might seem. If you don't feel like what you have, that intang the intangible quality that makes some people more persuasive than others. You too can easily become a persuasive presentation provided you practice little things which I am going to discuss now. Whether you are an entrepreneur pitching for funding, an executive presenting a proposal to a business partner or a public speaker looking to change a few minds with your presentation there are certain things you must simply follow. Firstly, move your hands. Hand gestures can work in tandem with words you say during your presentation, during your persuasion process. 
effectively becoming a second channel of communication between you and your audience. If you are using energetic and seemingly natural hand gestures to emphasize your words, you will come across as a more competent and more likable person. Whether you do, don't let your hands being awkwardly by your sides or locked around your podium in an anxiety-induced death trip. If you are worried about going overboard with your gestures, practice your hand movements in the mirror until your gestures feel simply natural. To be persuasive, my friends, relate to your audience by not only connecting to their minds, but also connecting to their hearts. We call in Nami winning the hearts and minds of the people. Actually, that is also related to the Good Samaritan word. Expressing interest of concerns that you share with your audience is one easy way to holistically connect to your audience. In addition, demonstrating enthusiasm for your message and the audience is another simple way to persuade your audience. Smile, ask questions and come across fully invested in your presentation and the audience members experience. My friends, also use trigger words. To be per persuasive, use carefully chosen words which connect instantly with not only the mind but the heart too. Address your audience and establish an emotional chord with your uh, target audience. And I tell people which I practice myself, use stories. A well-crafted story can take your audience for far away from business jargon land and inspire them to feel your message. Imagine scenarios and envision fresh ideas as a result of your story and most importantly the resulting emotional impact of, uh, of your tale. Your audience will like, uh, likely remember the overall message of a presentation and persuasion and will get engaged with you for further communication, for further relationship and dialogue. For your presentation, consider starting with a story, ending with a story and we, uh, weaving a narrative throughout your entire presentation. Whichever option you choose, your audience will likely refresh the experience. My friend, imagine you have mastered the great uh, art of persuasion, presentation and ultimately engagement. Right color choices. Learn the art of hand gestures. Put on a big smile, natural big smile. Told a compelling story. Then ask your audience to visualize the future along with you. By mastering those not so magical yet highly effective techniques, you have transformed into persuasive presentation and ready to engage and inspire with anyone to do just to do just about anything. Be a good engager in the conversation. Be an excellent persuader and a presenter. Thank you very much.